Hi there, I'm Maria, a 2005 graduate of Harvard Business School, a former board member of AGAC, and the founder of Applicant Lab. And in this video, I'm going to walk you through my top five tips for how to prepare for your MBA admissions interview. Number one, develop the right mindset. One big mistake I think people make is imagining that the interviewer is some grumpy antagonist who is rooting against you, trying to find fault in everything that you say, and mentally ripping you into tiny little pieces. Thinking this way ends up making you super nervous beforehand, and unfortunately it leads to people shooting themselves in the foot. In fact, this stereotype couldn't be further from the truth. Whether you're interviewing with a member of the admissions committee or with a student or recent alumnus or alumna, they all have a couple of things in common. Number one, they love their school. And number two, they are looking for nice people, nice just like them, to join the campus community. Which leads me to my first tip. Do not freak out by picturing the other person as someone who is against you. I promise you, this is a cordial conversation. When you're mentally preparing, picture the other person as a friend and not as a foe. I want you to be the most friendly version of you possible with lots and lots of positive energy and enthusiasm. They will respond in kind. Next, prepare by thinking about all of the possible stories and anecdotes you can use in the interview. I want you to brainstorm all of the details possible around your career vision, why an MBA, and why this school in particular. What's the rationale for that? Uh, as well as your top triumphs and your top defeats from your job, from community service, and from other facets of your life. You'll then move on to my third tip, which is to research a specific school's specific interview questions. A quick internet search will quickly pull up numerous reports, and after some research, you'll start to get a sense of each school's individual interview style. Once you've done that, you can move on to tip number four, which combines the previous two steps by having you map or match your brainstorm stories to the different questions you might get. This can really, really help you prepare if you know in advance which anecdote you'll use to answer each question. My final tip is to practice your answers out loud. No, not on paper, not in your head, not simply thinking to yourself, well, if they ask me question X, I'm going to answer with story Y. Trust me, that is not good enough. The first time you ever hear yourself giving an interview answer out loud, you are probably going to be horrified at how bad, or well, at the very least suboptimal, you sound. You do not want to come to this realization during the actual interview itself. <laughs> Practice each answer by recording yourself, and then ask yourself how could you make each answer tighter, more impactful, and with less jargon. Don't do this too much, though. I don't want you to sound too scripted, because then you risk sounding like a robot, and that's just terrible, because you want to sound natural. Now, if you liked these tips, you'll love Applicant Lab's $49 MBA Interview Lab. For less than one-tenth the cost of what other consultants want to charge you for a mock interview, you'll get brainstorming and mapping modules with in-depth analyses and school-specific research done for you along the way. Check out the free trial now at applicantlab.com slash MBA interviews. Thank you so much and good luck with your interview.